I thought while I'm busy working in the yard, I'd share our first campus trip. wonder why I'm going to use this in my yard and it's spring and you'll see that in an upcoming video but I'm going to take you on the first part of our first camping trip of the season as a family and uh, when that's over I've got a very, very small Yugo haul that, uh, I don't know where all my critters are. They're not around. Oh, there's one. A very small Yugo haul that pertains to camping that was great deals when Heather and I went out. I found my little purple basil. Now I'm losing my green one. I can't keep up. I hope nothing's ate it. <laughs> but, I'll be back at the end of the camping video to let you see what I got at the Yugo. Lacey's going for a car ride. She is. We're headed to the campground. Say it's late in the evening. I had to pull over just so I could document you riding with me. Yeah, she has to sit in my lap. She has high anxiety in the car. Do you ever do something for the first time in a while and you're second guessing, second guessing yourself? It's late evening. Uh, worked on the plants a little bit, took care of the animals, laundry, you know the drill. Then you gotta pack up. And then you have to give your little doggy a bath. Because it's time. Let's see what's going on here. It's bright and sunny. It's 6.13 in the evening. I'm probably going to be the last one at the campground. Hopefully, you me and my sister will get to come tomorrow. But, I don't know. Hope Omi feels like getting out. I think... She had therapy today, so that wore out. I talked to my sister. After Omi got back, I talked to Omi before she left. It's so pretty. I'm just gonna turn you around a minute. That way you can see it's sunny. 75 and sunny on a spring day. It is. And uh, hope Lexi does well. We're just gonna Two nights we're camping out. Late start to this one. We're going to Cove Lake State Park. Not too far from where we live. But our daughter Michelle's going to be there. Uh, Mo, the stepson, Michael, and his family's going to be there. I'm not sure about my youngest stepson. I know Michelle, I think try to contact them, but we're going to make it a family weekend. We are. And I might get to do a few videos along the way. Who knows? Yeah, you can see a lot of our stuff back there, and Kenny and Eli's got some of it. Say hi, Lexi. Say hi. But I had to pull over because my programming on my phone stopped. I don't mess with my phone when I'm driving. But, so now, it's showing I don't have Sigma. I'm out here in civilization and I don't have Sigma. Nothing on my phone. Probably just have to wait. Yeah, there's a Walmart right over there. Yeah, 
It's the end of the first night of our camping journey, isn't it, Lexi? We had hot dogs and hamburgers and chips, drinks. I had some snacks. But Lexi and I came out to walk and we're just sitting out enjoying the night. listening to the crickets. Don't know what that was. But yeah. In the morning, I will get up early, I hope. I elected it to go home to feed the animals this time. We're not that far from home. Totally different environment though. That's why we enjoy getting together. I didn't do much filming tonight, maybe tomorrow. Hopefully tomorrow, Omi and my sister will be here. That should be a trip in itself. But, I'll just probably will check back with you in the morning. And I plan on leaving Lexi here with the boys. She has done so well. Haven't you, Miss Lexi? You've been a good girl. Yes, you have. Couldn't ask for better. Lexi, we ended here last night. And we're starting out the morning here. It's gonna be a beautiful day. Hope Omi and Connie come today. We had a great time last night. Everybody's still asleep. Bet me and Lexi, we had to go, we had to go to the restroom, didn't we, gal? Uh, we have to go restroom. You're a good girl. You're a good girl. It's, there you are. <laughs> Say, I've done my business. I'm just chilling. Watching the squirrel. I seen it coming around from the camper after Lexi jumped down and was on guard. She's just sitting here watching, or standing here watching. Whoops. And that's the joys of sitting out in nature. I do that at home. Camping's a little bit different vibe. You have people all around and you get to meet new people, the sounds, the smells. Uh -huh. Lexi's used to that at home, aren't you, Lexi? She didn't even bark. I don't think she's barked since we left the house. Oh. Are you our official dog walker, Sadie? Yep, I had two dogs. Here, I had to pick up the camera. I wasn't picking it up, but since you're walking dogs, I thought I'd video. Lucy. That's Lucy. And this is Lexi. And of course, Lexi. Lucy's trying to make friends with Lexi, but Lexi's just kind of ignoring her, isn't she? Yeah. <laughs> this one is smaller, Lisa. She has a smaller collar. She has a bigger collar. Yeah. Bigger Lexi, leash. we're going to be lazy and not get up, but we're going to record Uncle Nick anyway. You want to? He's kind of playing. You say you should have brought your big grill. Oh, yeah. This okay. little camper grill ain't going to hold up. Well, it'll hold up. It just don't cook for as many, it does it? Cook for <laughs> hey, no... there's just enough room on there for one meal, and that's yours, right? I guess. Lord of mercy. They make this thing so compact. Oh. And that, yeah, they put a tie, uh, what, what'd you call it? A tie, is it tie rod? Railroad tie. Railroad tie. I'm going to say tie rod. Trying to kill somebody. Hey. 
Yeah, and you couldn't. You had to back up that far. You wouldn't have parking place. Our parking's tight. Start cooking a little bit, it falls right off. Just throw it right on there. Here it is. I have to bring them back when it's done. Yeah. She's yeah, she's getting she's getting bigger now. Bigger than that one? After all her birthday is coming up, Daddy. No, I want roller skates. For your birthday you want roller skates? Yeah. How about Mama's got some inline skates Eli got? That have the boot, the skates, and all. Yeah, you want those? Want and then you can get a new bike anyway. Because so Eli won't wear them. I'll bring them when you come back. If I can find them, I'll bring them when I come back. Okay? I, they're in my closet. If they're not too big for you, you can. I don't think he's going to use them anymore. He used them last year, remember? Yeah, when we last went camping. Yeah. When we went Papa's over there doing stretches. Remember, whenever you come back, get me the roller skates. I want to try to ride them. You want to try them? Okay. Me too. You want to try them too? No. Okay, they're sweetie. Too big for her. Well, she can try. She'll. She can tell if they're gonna fit or not. Hi, Papa. Hi, sweetie. What you doing? I'm stretching. What are you doing? Video on you. Video on me. Yeah. She's trying to ribble it between her legs. Bless her heart. Let me see you dribble between your legs. Boy, she's flying down the road. And so is she. And Eli, he's still in bed. He was up half the night with me. Boy, you were flying, gal. <laughs> he said he's about to flip my duck egg. I brought him a duck egg to try this morning. I thought he was going to get it burnt before I... What have you got, Adeline? really going to be disappointed. Oh, a basket of bowl of biscuits. Wow. Poor thing. Yeah. Look at those biscuits. Oh my gosh! <laughs> he said it tastes like a regular egg, the duck egg. This one here. He fried it so he knows which one's the duck egg. Does it have a little stronger taste to you? No? No. Ever You'd eat it again every day? Yeah, ever since COVID, I don't have a taste. Oh! <laughs> He's not the taste tester I'm a, then. <laughs> I'm a little late to the breakfast game. I've been chit-chatting. How could you? How could I? Y'all are about done eating. Was it good? What was your favorite part this morning? The bacon. Waking up. Waking up. <laughs> I'm going to go sleeping. enjoy. Oh, sleeping? Yeah. I'm going to enjoy breakfast. That looks good. <laughs> Turn them upside down. Tell you how my day's going. But I'm back. I promised you I'd show you what I got at the Yugo. When Heather and I went, I went for more stuffed puffs for camping. And could not find any till heading toward the checkout. And I found one bag, too, for a dollar. And I thought, well, at least one bag's better than none. 
And then Heather found the second bag and it said 34 cents. We could not find any more. I wish I'd stocked up. This one, the I wish I'd stocked up items. But anyway, I found two more bags. The ground beef. Black Canyon Angus beef. It's 73.27, no solutions added. 279 a pound. Almost three pounds in this pack. And almost three pounds in this pack. There's 10 patties a pack. So, another item I should have probably got more of. And if I get a chance before it goes off sale, because, you know, Memorial Day's coming up, I'll probably pick up some more and put them in the freezer. Got bananas so I wouldn't have to go into Walmart. But I'm going to have to go into Walmart in the morning. You'll find out a future time why. But, uh, got some bananas. And then, I was supposed to get cat food. I don't see a picture on here. Wasn't reading it. Told Heather, I said, I believe I need this bag. It looked good, lamb and rice. I should have known by that. It went from $13.99 to $9.99 for uh, 12 pounds. But guess what? I bought it for my cats. So this morning I ran out of their cat food. So this morning I gave them this. And then I was wondering why one of them was nipping me on the ankle in the backyard. Trying to tell me I gave them the wrong food. But I'll correct that this evening. I just thought I'd show you some camping and Memorial Day items. And if you have a you go, maybe you'll be fortunate enough to find some more of these stuff puffs. I better get busy outside again. I'll catch you later. And until next time.